HTTV in association with Absolute Warehouse Services. Terence, obviously we face Liverpool this weekend, a difficult game, but another one that you can test yourselves in. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a difficult game, they are top of the league. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, I think we train the last day is good. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's a tough season, but uh, fate is uh, still in the, in the team. The team spirit is uh, good. Uh, I think uh, every professional football wants to win. So uh, we go now with a uh, positive feeling to the game and uh, we have to give everything. Liverpool obviously are still challenging for the title. All the pressure's on them on Friday night, isn't it? Yeah, they have to win this game. Uh, but uh, <clears throat> for us, uh, for everyone in Huddersfield Town, for the fans, even for the people working, everyone wants to win this game also. It's a, it's a good game that you can test, your, uh, test yourself what you said. But um, yeah, they have to win. And uh, for me as a professional footballer, I want also to win this game. Is it easier when you go there with no pressure? No, pressure stays always. It's like uh, with me, uh, I want to play a good game. So it's, there's also a pressure to play a good game and uh, to try to uh, keep the clean sheet. So pressure stays always. And obviously to keep a clean sheet, you'll have to keep the likes of Mo Salah, Mane, Firmino quiet. How do you do that? Well, you see, I'm a defender. I try to do my job. Uh, we, we do with the whole team. Uh, and uh, we will see what the plan is for Friday. You've obviously been playing at centre half with Christopher Schindler recently. How have you found that relationship? Yeah, he's a good defender. Uh, play uh, almost every game. And yeah, uh, we have a good communication on the pitch. He talks a lot. Uh, and uh, yeah, I, I, res I respect him as a, as a professional football player. For me, he's a good, uh, good player. So. I can learn a lot, a lot of, uh, of Christopher Schindler. I think everyone can see how that relationship's developed as well over the last few weeks. Yeah, he's in play like he gives everything. Uh, he defends well, on the ball is good. So, uh, yeah, we try to keep the cliche at every game. It's not, uh, it's not easy, but every game uh, we, uh, we still try it. Anyone who sees you around PPG Canal side, knows what kind of character you are, you're quite jokey, quite lively. In situations like this, is that important to kind of keep that morale high? Who told you that? So I'm not, <laughs> I'm, you know, I'm relaxed, uh, shy guy, you know. <laughs> I don't speak much. But I don't know who told you that, but it's not me. <laughs> um, no, we keep the, the positive, we try to keep the positive spirit in the team. Uh, it's it's difficult if you if you lose in uh, in the weekend, but uh, after that, yeah, the life the life goes on. Uh, we have to learn from all the from all the games. You learn every day, so you have to keep that uh, uh, this. You have to keep that positive energy for the next game. Obviously, Liverpool. You have played with Van Dijk before, I believe, on international duty. What, yeah. What's he like? I think uh, he's really good. He's a, he's a good leader uh, with the head. He's strong. He's also uh, fast. Uh, you can learn a lot of, of him. Uh, and uh, <clears throat> yeah, for me, he's, a, he's one, uh, one of the best defenders. So he's a good player. Do you look at him because of how far he's come in his career, obviously, from Southampton to, to Liverpool as, as like a, almost an inspiration or someone to look up to? Yeah, he's an, uh, yeah, he, he's a good inspiration. He came from far and look where he is now. And uh, I think uh, he, he, will be, he will do better in his career. And uh, I've, I've also the confidence that he will be like the number one, real the number one. He, maybe he's almost the number one, but for me, he's a big example for the youth, uh, for the defenders also. So yeah, he can, he can look up. And Just finally, We've sold out again for the Liverpool game, the away end. The support <coughs> throughout the season has been amazing, but to have a group of fans that are so loyal, even though we've been relegated, is something unbelievable. Yeah, the fans this season, uh, last season when I was here, it was, <coughs> it's amazing. They support us 
home game, away game, in away game, you still hear them. So, you know, it gives you also uh, power and motivation in the game. And uh, I'm really thankful that I can, uh, yeah, have them like, you know, like an experience with the hardest few town supporters. Uh, this is amazing and they keep supporting us even when we lose. So, yeah, for me, when I play game and uh, I see the fans give me more power.